Well, grace and peace, everybody. This is Bishop. I want to just take a moment and give you a quick update uh, from me directly. Uh, we know that this is a serious situation as it pertains to the coronavirus, and I pray that your families are safe, know that you're covered under the blood of Jesus. Please use wisdom as you're going out. Make sure that you are in a place in which everything is sanitized and continues to be. Uh, someone even has shared with me, when you come in from outside, uh, allowing your garments to be separate and spraying them, uh, because sometimes uh, the residue lasts for several hours. But either way, I pray that you are well. I want to just greet all of you. I uh, love you. Can't hug you right now. Uh, but I wanted to express my love to you uh, as your pastor, as your bishop, and I just wanted you to know that we're praying for everyone uh, connected. I know I'm actually getting reports now of people who have been infected uh, by the virus that I do know, and so I'm very sensitive to that. I just wanted to give you an update as far as worship is concerned. Tomorrow, worship will be as scheduled at 1030, but we're going to be streaming it. Uh, you can watch it, catch it on our stream. Uh, via Facebook Live or uh, our Instagram. You can also listen to it if you don't have either option through our prayer call line. I'm going to include in a link to this video. Uh, so those are the three options for church tomorrow. I'm going to be preaching from the global pulpit tomorrow live uh, from the church, but we want to make sure that we're in uh, good standing with everybody and everything so we won't uh, open it uh, to the public massively but I am going to minister the word of the Lord tomorrow uh, and minister to you from your home or wherever you will be tomorrow. Next thing I want to share, starting this coming week until all of this lifts, every Wednesday we will be having a refresh prayer call at eight o'clock on our prayer line and we'll be getting that out. I also wanna make sure that we take this time of fasting and prayer seriously uh, because that one of the weapons of our warfare is prayer. We wanna be intentional with our intercession. Uh, We've always been a digital church, and so this does not change that. And so we will continue to uh, ask that you would be liberal in your giving uh, via giving online, text to give, uh, global to 51400. Uh, also, the dollar sign, GlobalFi Now, uh, via Cash App, and then our website, globalfinow.com slash give. Those are all viable ways of giving. I want you to keep Bishop Frank Dupre in prayer. Uh, he lost his mom this week. Bishop lost his mom, uh, as well as Pastor Mackie, who lost his mom. Uh, there's so many things going on and happening, but I want you to know that we are praying for you. Lady Dara and I, baby, we're all lifting you guys up. We're doing well on our end, and I hope that you're doing well on your end. So please stay connected. Uh, Elder Marissa's been doing personal check-ins. Uh, you have ways to contact her, have ways to contact me. Uh, we want to all stay connected. If you're having any issues uh, as far as landlords and things like that, uh, hit 311. Also, uh, there is a, a special number that you can contact if you go to newyorkcity.gov. Uh, they have resources there uh, as it pertains to uh, getting extra employment information or if you're facing a battling uh, different discrimination as it pertains to where you're staying and all of that during this time. So make sure that you make yourself available for that. I'm going to also include an article uh, in the link to this video that you can read. I want to make sure that you please, we're practicing social distancing, but I think we also should practice some social media distancing as well. Uh, the panic has been through the roof, uh, mass hysteria, and the media feeds off of that. So I want us to be sensitive, be discerning what you're reading, what you're sharing, and make sure during the season of Lent that you also stay in the posture of prayer. I want you to know how much we love you, how much we care about you. I have a word from the Lord I'm going to share tomorrow. Tune in and let somebody else know uh, that we are connected. I love you all. I want to bless you. Uh, in the name of the Lord Jesus, the Lord bless you and keep you. To cause his face to shine upon you. May his countenance be with you and may he give you his peace. Global is who we are. Fire is what we bring. Ministry is what we do. Expect greater. See you later. Bye-bye.